It's been three days since I last entered Bowser's castle. I've been wandering around this dank cave for the past two days. Why does Bowser have a cave in his castle? I don't get how this even works. I've been here for so long, the musky air has turned my voice into the voice of the Mario Brothers Super Show. I don't get what's going on. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to Jake Flies Around Blindly in the Dark, aka Paper Mario. It's been a while since I last recorded, although I think I might have up uploaded my last episode a couple days ago, so yeah. I do feel a little out of it, but that's just because I've had such a hard- No, not these enemies! They're, they're actually from hell! Okay. So I had kind of a, kind of a hard week. And that's not even the worst of it yet. I don't want a power block. I mean, I can see this being helpful, but no thank you. I have many better items. Like the Thunder Rays that, I'm, that I think I should just might as well use. This is the way- That's the way forward. Okay, well... How do I first strike an enemy in the dark? Oh, I get it, you don't. Oh, you do! Please don't have spikes. Okay. Ooh, we got flipped over! Oh. <laughs> well, that's not good. I forgot I already had no health. I, I can't really, you know, make a beeline back towards, you know, back towards Toad Town because then I have to fight through all these enemies again. This is a gauntlet, and I am very worried because I'm in grave danger. I kind of have to use Watt here, which is fine because Watt does good against these enemies, but... Oh boy, I'm gonna need some help here. I still have no idea why there's a cave in Bowser's Castle. I don't get this, this, part, this part of the chapter at all. Like, actually at all, so... I'm gonna hit the one in the back. Because that should make a spike go away. Get back over. Oh, okay. See, they, they do less damage when they have their spike back in. So I'll just jump on you then. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure these guys have 8 health, so I'll just, you know, do this. Oh, alright. I think I finally know how to beat these guys! I actually blocked something too. Ooh! Hello! Skills! They're coming back to me! <laughs> but then I'm gonna have to hurt this. Oh, never mind. Could have sworn I already did 5 damage to him, but... Oh, that was the guy in the back! Never mind. We're good. Ah! Easy money. Easy victories for me. Right now, it's raining. It's pretty... raining not super hard outside, but you know, it's still enough to make it to the point where it's raining. Remember that part in Undertale where Stan took you out to dinner? It's raining some worlds right now. Hey, kiddo. Insert reference here with Nagito Kamaida. Uh, okay. What, what the hell am I saying? Okay. I honestly don't even, I don't even remember this part very well. I think kind of a weird day to record because nothing else is happening today. So, I mean, that can be good because time, but that's also bad because I don't really have anything to immediately talk about. Aside from me going through a dank cave, trying to survive, fighting really hard enemies. <laughs> I may have figured out a battle plan. Oh god, there's Koopa Chills wandering here too. Man, why would Bowser appoint us to stay in this super shitty cave? It smells in here, man! <laughs> oh god. And they're coming for me. Oh god. No! Leave me alone! Okay, just stay right there. Never mind! <laughs> and now things are dark again. Which means I can't do shit unless I have these guys out. Okay. I have no star power either. That's really not good, actually. Um... I don't know how to approach this. This is... <laughs> um... 
I guess I could just fo- This isn't gonna do anything. I'm a terrible person, so I'm gonna do this. Because I have no skill and I don't know how to plan things. But I don't really want to cut this out either, so... Alright. I'm gonna get some star power back. Okay, looking good. Looking good. Um, I am also going to... I can only use Y. He's good for taking down single enemies. Well, she, but like... Oh god, this hurts. Um, screw it, I'll just go for what I gotta do. I'll take it up one at a time. Oh, I couldn't block that one, but I can block the other ones. There we go! Oh, I'm gonna have to block them if I want to survive in this world. Um, okay, Jake, you're doing good, you're doing good. Oh, wait. I'll charge up with Mario, my star meter, because he fills it up more. Alright, I got some things down, I got, I got a strategy going. Commentary is dead right now, and I don't know what the hell happened, but yeah, otherwise I got something got, got something down. Just block everything and you'll be fine. I mean, it's true, the Koopa Show may one-shot me next turn, so... I'll just kill him and then, you know, take care of that bony spiny. Because he can't one-shot me with his spikes in. God, this section is really scary. But, eh, at least we took care of it. Wait, no, no we're not. We still have one more enemy to deal with. Um. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> I didn't real- I forgot he had that much defense. Um, okay. We're good. We're good. Just take care of him. Okay, we're fine. <gasps> Oh, hey, look at that! I got double experience again. Good, good, good shit on me. Good shit on me. You know what I realized? I haven't really been able to do, like, anything... Like, special with these episodes. Like, you know, like, maybe have, like, a guest come over for one time. I never really did that because, like, I thought it would be kind of boring, like, for them. Like, if I just played this single-player game. While they kind of just sat there. <laughs> Giving extra commentary, but like, I don't know. I also haven't, you know, been able to do any just any just group videos for this channel in a while in general. Like with a guest over. I oh I couldn't block that. There goes six health already. But this is okay, this is actually much easier. Wait a minute. No, I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, bitch! Eat it! Okay. Well, yeah, I wish I, maybe I could do that again. But! Uh, I just haven't really had the opportunity to do that, so. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna hope that you spend your time charging up this turn. I'm gonna focus again. Get my star gauge back up. Perfect. Now I'm gonna do this again. Okay, see, this is how you get your shit back up. You see, I'm afraid to God that your enemy acts like an idiot. And if they do, then you're rolling in dough. Just don't mess this up and you're fine. Okay. <laughs> I think I almost released it a tad too early. And then I would have taken 10 damage and died. So, even if I blocked it, I still would have died. Because I would have done 8. So, that would have been bad. Oh, it's a block up there too. Boy, this game really wants you to use what? Oh, great. Something actually useful. That's good. Thank God. Normally this shit's been not useful. Ahem, the POW block. Why do they give you POW blocks so late in the game? I know like some enemies are weak to them. Like, you know, usually the Cooper variant ones, but like, still. You have better ways of dealing with that. You probably have Quake, the Quake camera badge on. Uh, no. Gotta save my full heal for later. Jeez, you just kind of went for it. And I was a, like a couple frames. Oh! Oh god, they got Magic Koopas down here too. 
Um, once again, I'm terrible at this game, but I feel like these fights are interesting enough to watch, not to listen to my terrible voice, to just, you know, to witness. Wait, who shouldn't even go for here? Um, I'll just do this again. I'll do the exact same thing I did last time. This kind of boils down to it in the scheme of things, like when you're low on health and you're kind of struggling to survive, you just use that move. Here, you, do less damage to me right now, please. Yeah, that's better. Ah. Hey, I actually blocked that one. What happened to him? Oh. Well, I think I know what I'm doing to this one. <laughs> you can go away. Goodbye, Fiend. Um, my FP isn't the problem here. I mean, I probably could just like spam a bunch of those moves, but... Oh yeah, I could do that. Ow. I'm gonna keep you alive, Magic Koopa, because you can get some good experience. Now I'm gonna kill you! Because you get good experience. And because if, if every enemy is dead, you just run away. I learned that way back in Chapter 5. <laughs> And the one yellow Magic Koopa just backed away because everyone else was dead. Because he couldn't do his job, so... Okay. There. See, we're good. We're good. I'm dead inside, but otherwise we're good. This whole episode was just me doing shit. In the cave. Why is this cave portion taking so long? Nintendo, why do you forsake me like this? Come on. More script More crossroads. Come on. This one probably has an item up on it. Okay. Oh no, that's the right way to go. You guys, you guys know the halftime show, right? Well, uh, no, of course you do. It's the Super Bowl halftime show. Everybody knows it. I don't know a single person on this earth who hasn't heard of it. Even a sport, even a sports non-interested person like me would know. What's down there? And the people are drilling again. There's people drilling outside my house. <laughs> I don't, I'll get back to what I was talking about with the um, halftime show in a second. But yeah, in my area, there's always construction going on over here. Oh, this is the way back. I'm gonna get sniped. Yep, he shot me. <laughs> I move so slowly. Oh, oh god. Um. <laughs> hey, I wonder if Bob. I mean, I'm still able to attack. Nope, I just straight up can't attack. I mean, what if I just told Bombette to explode? She could still do it. The screen new moves wouldn't matter because they just end up hitting everything anyway. But no. Oh, I know what to do. I can still use out of sight, so... I can't use any items. Oh, wait, no! Oh, this is good. This is why the quick change back is so amazing. I can see them with this. I hit them with that. And now... Pull out bow, use the old out of sight maneuver, and we're good. I still have no idea how they can see in the dark. Oh, okay. Never mind. Uh oh. He's electrified, and he's charging up. Change it back to watch so I can see. And, oh, wait, um, that one's still gonna hit me. And I'm one point short. <laughs> I'm, like, actually a pixel short of using a star stool. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna take it. This will kill everyone else. It does 10 damage, so... Oh, God. <laughs> Well, I'm at, I'm at peril, and at this point in the game, it's kind of rare to be at peril, so... <laughs> Jesus. 
I'm gonna focus. I'm gonna focus on my big math test that I got coming up. Yeah, that's right, Mario. Just pray to God that you don't die. Pray to God I don't mess this up. There we go. That's what you call smart tactics, folks. Yes, 12 experience points. All I need to do is fight one more battle and I'll be good to go. I can stop being, you know, on death's gate. <laughs> I'm gonna go up here. No. Use the thing. But yeah, where I, where I live, there's always people drilling outside. And no, no, please, dear God, don't first strike me. I want to see what's up here first. This is a long path. There is nothing up here. Okay, great. There's an enemy, though. And you know what? I will fight the enemy. Never mind, he has spikes on. Oh, no! Okay. My only hope is the first is to is to block this first strike. You can, I know you can. Can I? Did I just screw myself here? No, there's no way. Yep, you can. You can. Okay. We're good. We're good. I'm gonna cut this out really quick. It's pretty obvious what I'm gonna do here. Rawr! There we go, <laughs> and there you go, we're good. Oh my god, you shouldn't have. <laughs> I mean, thank you, that gives me a bit of a head start for the next level. Ooh, all right, eight point lead. And now, yeah, since BP is maxed out, we can't upgrade it anymore, so, well, let, let's try it. Yeah, you can't, you can't increase BP anymore, so, HP, <laughs> that thing I needed now. And there we go. We are finally leveled up again. And yeah, that was done. But anyway, back to what I was gonna say. With the Super Bowl, you got you guys you guys already know what happened, man. You know exactly what happened. They teased it! They teased the song. Oh god. They teased us with sweet victory. Only to give us sicko mode! You know, you've seen the memes. First, what's happening here? What poor taste, what an egomaniac. If we push this thing, what do you think will happen? What What will happen? I'm um, probably the other side. No. Oh, it made a door appear. Well, okay, hey. Hey, we made it back! What? <laughs> you came back? You escaped from that underground jail? Oh, that's what it was. But there was no way you could escape! Urgh, of all the dirty tricks! I guess I have to keep my word. You can go through. But don't think I'll forget this! Oh, how nice. He actually let us through. I thought he was gonna eat us. Oh well. Oh, finally a break point. After the hellhole that was that cave. Let's see what's over here. Um. I'm gonna look around first. <laughs> I mean, I know our objective is to go up, so maybe that is like just a good place to go to, but I don't know, I want to look around first. But yeah, why would they do that? Probably just for money. I don't know. Oh, it's a shop here. Um, hey. Huh? Who are you, man? I don't know your face. Maybe you're Mario. <laughs> nah, just joking. I'm the guard of this warehouse, and I'm super bored. If you got any coins, I'll sell you stuff. Oh, you're loaded! Okay, sure. Alright, well, this stuff is really expensive, but... I will buy this again. Because, hey, a quick healing item is always useful. Okay, anyway, now I'm going. It took a bunch of time for them to, like, buff the healing power, like, you know, the... The, the regular and old super mushrooms. <laughs> the regular mushrooms become worthless after like three chapters. Super mushrooms are kind of useful, but like, eh. You know. Oh, and if I look the other way. The they, I'm still angry about that, you know, the whole sicko mode thing. <laughs> Everyone's faces. I bet even the people at the concert, even the people who were cheering were probably really upset. Okay, that's another magic hoop. I'm just gonna go. Even the people who were cheering, even the people who saw that, you know, the, the singer take his shirt off or whatever and go apeshit. I bet even they were still upset. 
That sweet victory wasn't played. They teased it at first. And then, you know, I just heard them say, it's lit. And then, you know, blow, blow, blow. God, not only is Sick of just a bad song, but why would they not play Sweet Victory? I'm just gonna. Do I just attack this guy? Yeah, I just fight him. <laughs> and now I no longer have to use Watt. Even though Watt is still like the best person for taking these guys on, so. Wow. Hey, come at me. Bitch! Yeah! <laughs> like, jeez, why would they make Watt the best character for taking them on? Then have a whole area where you have to just use Watt. I just don't get it, man. But, this also means I'm gonna do this and kill you. <laughs> oh, no. Jesus Christ, Jake, you idiot. Why do you think the NFL teased us with, sick, with Sweet Victory only to give us Sicko Mode in the end? To kill the fans? Leave your comments down below if you give a shit, but... I was talking about, about that for so long. Well, actually, I still am, but... Ooh, okay. I just can't believe they did that. Steven Hillenburg passed away. And this is how they respect him? By using like a 10 second clip. Only to... Only to completely spit in Sweet Victory's face with Sicko Mode. Not even a good song! Sicko Mode! Oh! Oh god, it makes me gag. Hey, 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 hey there, Arabic Toad, how you doing? I came all the way from Dry Dry Desert to Peach's, Cross to Peach's Party, and look what happens! I've been to some lame parties, but this is ridiculous! I want to go back to the desert as soon as possible. <laughs> yeah, that guy's not very happy, I imagine. Mario, you're safe. Oh, oh, I'm so happy for you, Mario. Okay. We all got captured bef before we knew what was happening. The few people at the party were able to get away, but they caught most of us. I went to a peaches and the minister. I mean, I think the minister is somewhere at the beginning of the castle. I don't know. I'm not talking to the rest of you guys. Wait. Oh, we can take a nap here! I don't need to, I already leveled up, but, you know what, screw it. <laughs> the toad says, These are difficult times, please rest! <laughs> ah, nice bed. Did you sleep well? No, I fucking did not! Oh, shh! I should be quiet, otherwise they'll find us! <laughs> you know, you guys could probably leave. Or at least, you know, go to this side of the room and have a bit more space. <laughs> Yeah, if a fight ever breaks out, just like separate the room. Maybe move one of the beds to the other side of the room if you can, so that, that, way, that way they're even. But <laughs> prison compromises. Oh god. I wonder if there's a Reddit section on that. R slash shower thoughts. That's where I like to spend most of my time. Not actually. I have done nothing but browse R slash DDLC for the past three days. <laughs> no. No! Oh god! Oh god, well... I mean, it's better than taking four damage, I guess. Oh, but this is... Not a good situation, but... The good thing is, I can actually kill them now. Alright. Black Alexa does five damage, right? Well, we're gonna see in a second. Oh, well, it doesn't matter anymore. He fell off his room. Hit the guy way in the back. Square in the face. Donk. Okay, yeah, we're good. Uh, I can block these. Never mind, I guess I can't. My skill- he's invisible, isn't he? Oh. My skill's all gone. <laughs> uh, oh. What do you guys think about the idea that we, you know, we're getting close to the end of this game? I feel kind of the same feeling I felt when I was doing this for Thousand Year Door way back when. It feels fun acting, kind of, but... I still have no idea how he can hit me. Oh god, I'm really bad at blocking these. Again, but the, the feeling's also kind of different, though. Oh, I straight up can't hit him, so... 
Uh... What do I do here? I can't hurt that guy in the back. With anything, so... Um... You know what? Black Alessio, I guess you're coming back out. Um... Maybe just throw an egg at him. No, 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 no. You know what? You know what? I'm doing this. RNG, guide me to victory. If I can't block them, I'll just dodge them. And, um... Happened to my massive accumulation of star power already, but you know what? It's okay. I can always just charge it back up when I have the opportunity to. It's okay. Oh! Okay, I see what's going on here. That's really good. <laughs> Acting like I didn't shit myself. Okay. I guess I'll just kill the guy in the front and hope the god I live. I mean, and maybe. Oh. I hope the guy he misses is what I meant to say. There, you're dead. Miss, please. Well, I mean, if he does hit me, then I won't, I'll be safe. Oh, he missed. Thanks, spirit guy who gave me the thing. If you buffed up my experience there with that amount, I would. I probably would have orgasm, but okay. <laughs> okay. We're good. We're okay. Is it bad that I'm still angry about the Super Bowl thing? Oh, God. Well, hello. Oh, God. These fuckers. They're out of the cave, too. At least I can finally scan them and see what, what the hell they are. No. I'll do that later. I want to kill the Magic Cubas first. You know why I want to do that? Because these guys are annoying as hell. I don't want them to shoot at me, so I'll just kill them. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot it. It's delayed. What did... Oh, my God. He cloned himself? How did he do that? I didn't even know he could do that. Oh, well, there's only one way to find out which one's the real one. Ha-ha! <laughs> Ha-ha! Bitches! And you're dead. I feel very skilled doing that. Title. Okay, what are your stats? It's a bony beetle. They're like bo they're like bony buzzy beetles. Hence, hence the name. Max HP is eight, attack power is three, and defense power is four. It's really tough to damage them. When the spikes are out, their attack power is five. When they attract the spikes, take the opportunity to flip them over. After that. Beating him will be just a breeze, Mario. Just a nice light breeze. Okay. Um, I will not let you hit me. I can do two damage with just a regular attack, so... Ooh! And he did, Bo. He did. Hey, they still give two experience. That's not bad. That's good. Yes, give me the FP. Okay. Ooh. No! There, I, I hit his toe. Oh, there's like... There's a lot of them. Okay. Well, I think I know how to take care of this. Easily. It's the lightest screen nuke ability I have. Oh, I can use my main man Lackluster here. Alright, Mario, I'm gonna hit him up. Uh, take my eggs! <laughs> good, good. I don't want him to heal right now, so I'm just gonna do this. And kill them all. And get loads of money. Ooh, big money, money, money. Bitches. Money and the bitches. Okay. Good stuff. You see that? They're all dead. Oh, wait. I'm not sure if I talked about, you know, Smash Ultimate since the plant came out. <laughs> the plant. The day of the plant is finally upon us, folks. I'm sure you've heard the news. I like to think that I, I main point of play, but that's not really the case. I don't pl I don't play him properly, so I kind of well, I mean, I have kind of have the wrong mindset when playing him. He's fun, but I just don't use him correctly. I play him like I play Bowser sometimes. 
when we see Like I found, I found myself side being thinking it'll be a command grab. I was like, oh yeah, it's just poison breath. But then you know, I actually use this poison breath the way it's meant to be used, and then I get like 50 damage on my opponent after jabbing them in there. <laughs> And I feel like a scumbag afterwards, but hey, you know what, that's fine. Better than Zelda's ridiculously easy to land forward error. <laughs> Seriously, it's a great out of shield option. Okay, well, whatever. I'll get rid of my salt for now. Let's talk about how I'm happy he's in. Oh, but I've also heard, I've also heard. Have you guys seen that post about... You, you, know, you know Fire and the Three Houses, right? New Fire Emblem game coming out someday. The voice actor for one of the characters in that game, I think the character's name was Edelgard, just tweeted about how, like, it was kind of like a brag tweet about how she got, like, a role like, one of the biggest games ever. And then, like, one of her friends, I mean, like, a reference to Smash Bros, congratulating her. So I was thinking, okay, how could this not be Smash? And this could only mean one thing. We're getting another Fire Emblem character for Smash Bros. <laughs> that basically confirms it. And many fans are going to be very upset. Of course, I was kind of upset to, you know, not have it be my main man. But here's the good thing about it being Edelgard and not another Fire Emblem character. Edelgard's an axe user. And not a sword user. <laughs> Which means you really shouldn't be that upset at her. That half of the reason why people hate Fire Emblem characters so much is gone, because they hate them because, like, oh, they're a Fire Emblem character, which is valid, and it's another sword fighter. But half of the hate towards Edelgard is gone because she's an axe user and not a sword fighter, so she won't be that, she won't be, like, as angry as, like, you know, when we got, when we saw Corrin. <laughs> I'll admit, even I was upset when I saw Corrin. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> why couldn't I have gotten mandated to <laughs> Or Knuckles? <laughs> Because at the time, I was, you know, I really have a Knuckles wander. And now it's too late, but. <laughs> now we have a higher water level. We're playing with water gimmicks here, folks. Fun stuff. Once I get past two, I'll end the episode off. You know, theoretically, Life Lesser could go across this water. He can he can do it to lava. Why not water? But whatever. I mean, to be fair, I guess he can't go under it like Sushi can, so... Yeah, but, you know what that means. If a Nintendo character gets into Smash, that means my boy. My main man, Bandana Waddle D. Best character for Smash Brothers, Fight Me, is also, is also you know, eligible again. Which means we aren't going to be getting just third-party characters because, you know, Edelgard. So, we can only hope, folks. We can only hope with his amazing moveset potential. And, um, you don't even want me to go on further. What happens if I got onto this again? Oh, it goes back down! Good, I'm gonna kinda need to know that. <laughs> but seriously, his bandana needs movement potential is so good. Well, I wouldn't say like movement. I mean, maybe with the waddlecopter, but. Move set potential is what I meant to say. He can mainly use his spear because that's what he's been mastered with, but like, he can have some parasol moves. Throw in some beam moves while you're at it. And hell, if you really want to, you can use some of the vehicles that that, that one Waddle Dee used in Kirby 64. Assuming that's the same Waddle Dee. I like to think that is the same Waddle Dee as Bandana Dee. I don't know why it wouldn't. I don't really see a good, good reason to make them not the same person. So, yeah. Bandana Dee's appearance is in 64, guys. Okay, never mind. Go down even further. And somehow there's no wetness on the ground. It's just completely dry. I mean, then again, it is paper water, so I don't really know what to expect. Open. But yeah, I just want my guy in. What's up here? Oh, there's a- Oh god, it's the cannon section. I knew something like this would happen. Don't hit me, please. Okay. Oh my god. If you look really closely, you can see the bullet bills crying as they hit the wall. Is this what happens? They get born, shot out of a cannon, and then die? They're like kamikaze fighters. Bullet, bullet, bullet bills are like kamikaze fighters. They are. They're like kamikaze pilots. They crash into things and die. 
bullet bills are kamikaze pilots. I don't know why I had that revelation so late in this video, but it's true. It is actually true. And because I'm running out of things to say, I'm going to end this episode off right here. Because it kind of dragged on the first part and picked up later in this episode. And I'm sorry about that. I'm just kind of out of touch. But I will see you guys next time.